At Audiology Associates of Prestonsburg, you can live your life the way you want and find the freedom of better hearing. You'll experience patient care that is specific to you with exceptional follow-up care that ensures your hearing and balance needs are being met. Audiology Associates at 1428 North Lake Drive in Prestonsburg. The McCall Art Gallery, located at Big Sandy Community and Technical College, will be holding the opening reception of Appalachian Quintessence Traditional Appalachian Art by Terry Burchett, Wednesday, January 25th. Burchett is an artist from Lawrence County and attributes Eastern Kentucky as one of his greatest influences. So Terry's work, and we, we do tend to see quite a bit of Appalachian work, it's not always Appalachian work, but but it pretty often is. It's a lot of regional stuff, and that's what his stuff is. Um, one thing that's a little bit different is that Terry studied under um, Tom Whitaker, and Tom Whitaker has been a big influence on him. Tom Whitaker uh, has kind of prided himself as one of the, the biggest Appalachian artists. He passed away just a few years ago. So I think honoring Tom's legacy through style and also um, just kind of a visionary sense that Terry has is really important. Birch's exhibits include canvas paintings as well as barrels, hand saws, and other traditional objects from Appalachia. The exhibit is free to view and will remain at the McCall Art Gallery until March 1st. I just think it's very important to support the arts and you know, it's one of those things that people are always complaining in Eastern Kentucky about not having enough to do. And it's just something really good to do. It's something that families can come to. It's something that I think really with the kind of work that Terry does, all ages can enjoy. And it's just a great opportunity to get out and do something in the community. The reception is free to attend and will begin at 3 p.m. at the McCall Art Gallery. For more information on the exhibit, go to McCall Art Gallery of BSCTC on Facebook. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Brianna Robinson.